It's been a tradition since 1911 until a pandemic forced the Chesterfield County Fair to be canceled last year. But it's back this year and the gates are open. Our Antoinette Essa has more in tonight's a -list. Well, you know, the Chesterfield County Fair is back, and in fact, the gates are already open. And guess what? You're invited to come. We've got Brenda White with us to talk about this fair. Almost two years you've yes. been not... Well, talk about this. Oh. Everybody's so excited. Well, I tell you, we are so excited. We are elated to have a fair. We think people are ready to get out and, and catch the fun, as yes. we say, yes. and come and join us here for all these rides, the food, the entertainment, the parades, everything. The rodeos, yes. the animal yes. shows. Absolutely. Yes, we have nine full days, nights at eight o'clock every night at the grandstand. Great entertainment. You know, we started off Friday night with Jim Quick and Coastline, and we go the whole gamut. There's all sorts of music. What, no matter what type you like, we've got it here. And the rodeo is the final weekend, the final Friday, September 3rd and 4th. It's Rafter Z Rodeo. Okay. And right before that, they do the mutton busting with the kids, where they, they <laughs> corral the sheep and all that stuff. So The fair started in 1911 yes. for local farmers as an agricultural mm -hmm. fair. And now it's just uh, yes. taken over. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Chesterfield County has grown so much. It's not so much agricultural and rural anymore. It's grown to where it's it's more than that. Uh, we still um, celebrate our agricultural heritage. We have an arts and crafts building. We have Heritage Village, all sorts of things that you can enjoy here. And the fair runs through September 4th, right? Yes, ma'am. How can they get more information? Uh, yes, at our website, which is ChesterfieldCountyFair.org. Okay, and you're open tonight to what time? Till 11 p.m. every right. night. Brenda, thank you. Thank you. Of course, the Chesterfield County Fair, you can get more information on our website, WTVR.com.